Hey guys, welcome back to Screen Time. The Dr. Phil Show first aired back in 2002 with the premise of helping conflicted individuals with any sort of personal or family issues. The host, Phil McGraw, holds a doctorate in psychology, so he is well equipped to deal with all kinds of people appearing on this show. Even after hosting a show for 18 something years, Certain individuals can leave you surprised at the way they behave in front of a camera. But sometimes, to deal with these especially irrational people, with emotions soaring all over the place, they have to be put in their own place, in a particularly humbling manner. This is a list of top 5 Dr. Phil's most savage moments. But before we begin, make sure you also subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon so that you don't miss out on anything. Also, if you're a fan of the show, then do give this video a like. Number 1. He Needs to Go First up is this hilarious case of quote unquote sexy vegan when a man legitimately named sexy vegan came to the show in 2017 with his weird and extreme personality. Dr. Phil got very irritated by him. The guy kept going on and on with an annoying attitude making a fool out of himself. Dr. Phil, frustrated with the situation, finally decided to do something about it. In his usual smooth and sassy tone, he called out for his security, motioned by his finger towards the door, and told them to take him out of there. Dr. Phil's slick move surely pissed Sexy Vegan off, but that was not the end of it for him, as he found the audacity to reply to Dr. Phil with a, now I can finally leave. Dr. Phil bowed him farewell with a more fierce reply. Dr. Phil really is a smooth talker. Number 2. Gary the Human Dog Dr. Phil has always been an expert at hitting people with cold and brutal truths. Gary was a 48 year old man obsessed with the idea of a dog. He would dress up in a dog costume every day and roam about the streets like a dog. It is pretty obvious that a case like this was certain to get on Dr. Phil's nerves. However, in his usual style, without any hesitation, Dr. Phil told the man that he is just wasting his life as his whole routine was just not so very productive. And the fact that he has no actual job, he further makes it his point by making a sarcastic joke saying, if someone wants to take you home, just don't go. With the whole audience as well as Gary himself cracking and laughter. Gary was really hilarious to look at, though someone needed to give him a reality check and no one could have been better at it than Dr. Phil. Number 3. Take Some Responsibility When a teenager decided to drop out of college, Dr. Phil made him realize the groundbreaking rules of survival. Though teenagers are the worst to deal with, Dr. Phil tried to make him understand the fact that in a very reasonable tone. But even in his calm tone, Dr. Phil manages to tell him that his decision to drop out of college is totally nonsense. Dr. Phil knocked some sense into the kid by saying, the only way to survive this world is to take responsibility and get a job. Now that can be a bit heavy for a teenager, but you cannot reason with Dr. Phil. Number 4. Stop Interrupting Me The fourth one on this list is when a loquacious woman came on the show and kept on interrupting Dr. Phil and justified her unruly behavior. The show is famous for showcasing a number of individuals with some very disrupting personalities. Though Dr. Phil is an expert at dealing with these kinds of people, he surely doesn't like it when someone interrupts him. While Dr. Phil was trying to talk to this woman, he kept on getting cut off by her. So he replied with an accurate level of attitude to not interrupt him. The woman got offended and decided to leave, to which Dr. Phil replied, keeping his manners intact. Okay, so you can walk off. I'll must play the tape after you leave. Dr. Phil always just knows what to say. Number 5. You don't know what you're doing. When a young teenager leaves high school, and decides to embark on the journey of fame and start a YouTube channel, she gets told off by her parents. Apparently, the little girl did not seem to take it well. She made it clear she absolutely hates her parents for stopping her from becoming famous. She even calls her mother a psychopath. 
Dr. Phil's reaction is hilarious. When asked what a psychopath really is, the girl just goes off and on and on, not knowing what it really is. Dr. Phil listens to the girl's jabber for a while and then smoothly cuts her off by saying, yeah, that's not what a psychopath really is. The whole audience applauded Dr. Phil on this one. Dr. Phil is the king of making savage and sarcastic remarks. Dr. Phil has also appeared on The Oprah Winfrey Show and is widely famous for his unremarkable sassy attitude. His smooth personality and expertise is the reason why he is admired by everyone. This brings us to the end of our video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you haven't liked the video yet, it's never too late. Give it a thumbs up, people. We will see you soon in another video. Until then, take care and goodbye.